Well, good evening, everybody. Hello, hello. Welcome to another great live with us. What if it's not great? What if it's just mediocre? Nah, we never do mediocre stuff. Are you kidding? Oh, boy. Our That's stuff is, rough, guys. Our stuff is like always like phenomenal. Amazing. Are you? It is. I, you know me and egos. I am not about egos and that was kind of ego just saying you just saying i wouldn't say our stuff is phenomenal i say our stuff is inspirational is that better because i don't that's like really phenomenal that's not i don't like that i know it's a little ego hello maisha so guys how's it going um good. so we are on twitch to this is our first time on twitch so uh Please be nice to us over there. And Sean's ready to block people. I'm just saying. <laughs> so give me a second. I'm going to share to a few places and then we will get going. Yes. I think this was how it works. He doesn't know. I'm trying. You know what? That's all we can do, Sean. That's all I'm we trying. can do. If you want to join us on Twitch, you can. I think this is it here. Ryan told me a whole bunch of stuff I was supposed to do before... We can actually get a channel or something. I don't know. Yeah, we, but have, we have to do seven days, eight hours worth of streaming. It sounds like we're going through rehab. I'm just <laughs> I <know>. saying. <laughs> we have to do seven days, and then we have to do this. Yeah, yeah, exactly. So if you want to, you can re join us over there. We're trying to get as many people as we can join. Um, he did tell us if we, if you, after after everything is all said and done if you have an amazon prime account you can actually subscribe uh, for free to the twitch account yeah because normally it costs but i guess if you i don't know that much about twitch for the longest time i called it twat so <laughs> um so but yes he was saying that if you are an amazon prime user you will get it for free and you won't hmm. have to pay for that yeah oh i'm sorry carol i don't know why that we couldn't interact with everybody but for those who did get to do it thanks for doing that it was fun. We had yes, fun. So we did. Um, and I'll explain why we're going on um, Twitch, right? Yeah. Um, let me go ahead and I just have one more couple places. Just a couple. I gotta get my uh, one, this one up and running real quick. First, I gotta do that. I don't know what it is about Facebook when I share. I think Facebook doesn't like me sharing because it just slows it down. Okay, one more place, and I swear we're going to get ready, guys. So, welcome to 45 Days of Live. Um, hello, new person. How are you? We have a new person. Um, yeah, what? she said new here. Oh, well, congratulations for finding us and joining us. Um, Thank you so much. So, we have committed to doing 45 Days of Live. We mm -hmm. did have one snafu with Toby. He's doing much better. Thank you, everyone that yes. is asking. Thank you very much. Um, and so... We're going to do our 45 days live. So if you know anyone that is interested in Chocolate Tour, let me know. Mm -hmm. um, here we go. And uh, please share, 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 share. So share, share, um, like. welcome everyone. We're going to do a fun Christmas project today. Um, we're doing a lot of Christmas, I know, but it is Tis the Season. If you've tis missed out on season. our um, other ones, definitely take a look at our YouTube channel where they're posted. They're also posted on Facebook. We've done six projects now. This will be our seventh. And we're going to do a paste and pull, which is a bigger project where we kind of paste then pull. Mm -hmm. So we're using just one transfer, one board, a couple different paste colors. We are using glitter, so Sean will be excited. Oh, yep. So any of those who, any of those people that are, have been afraid doing the larger transfers and stuff, this is the true way of getting it done correctly without freaking out and going, oh my goodness, I don't think I'll ever be able to do it. You will. It's going to be, you this is will. an easy way to do it. All right, easy, so easy, easy. all I'm going to be doing while you guys are entering and interacting with Sean, mm -hmm. like I said, if you guys are over on Twitch, hello. Hello, everybody. Um, There's that. Okay, situation. just want to make sure we're also watching it. But um, I'm just going to be stirring my pace, getting it all ready. The colors we're using for today's project are Candy Apple Red, yes. Rainforest, Grige, Bright White, and peony. Mm -hmm. And do you guys want to know something kind of fun? What's that? So in my links, which should be um, underneath the video or somewhere, uh, there is a new thing called a holiday recipe guide. 
And what this is, is Chocotour has actually broken down the Holiday Suite catalog and told us what all the paste colors they used in every... Oh, how cool. Yeah. Neato burrito. Cool. So, um, so yeah. Can, so this be, can this be done on foam core? Yeah. It can. You have to be Careful. sure to and vary... Fuzz, fuzz, fuzz. Fuzz, 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 because foam core is that paper covered foam, of course. Mm -hmm. um, why they call it foam core, but... If your uh, transfer is a little too sticky, it'll pull up the paper too. We've done it. Some of it would pull, and other parts would so just have to the make sure it's The problem we did off. is I did a very big project. Yeah, I did a big, paste big. and pull, and I didn't fuzz it enough. So I'd be very cautious, and I would also make sure that the foam core you're using is of high quality. This can be done on cardstock too. So that's the nice thing about Chalk Couture is that we have a lot of different surfaces you can use it on, and you can use a lot of different mediums through our chalk transfer. Mm. Um, so basically it is a silk screen with an adhesive on the back. We call them chalk transfers. What I'm doing right now, for those of you who are not familiar, can we go to this camera view for I just a sure second? can. Is because I'm doing the paste and pull method, we want to make sure this paste is good to go. So we are looking for a consistency of right around, I say cake batter. And... Yeah, thanks everybody who's joining us over there on Twitch, and especially if you're absolutely new and never seen this before, thank you for joining us. Twitch, Twitch, this Twitch. This is our second Twitch. I guess that's uh, where all the thing. cool kids are doing all it. All the cool kids are here. Or over on the Twitch. Although it's funny, we had a couple people that said they were like Twitch grannies. Or I love it. We love it. It's I love it. Great. Um, so I am broadening my horizons because mm -hmm. my book tells me to do that. I'm mm -hmm. reading Red Ocean, Blue Ocean. And Red Ocean is full of vultures and um, evil people in the world. Don't stop. It just says that basically <laughs> if you just copy what everyone else is doing. Um, and I'm not just talking chocolate I'm talking big picture. Um, that you're going to end up getting overwhelmed. And um, essentially, I hate to say it, but it's Red Ocean because people start attacking each other. Mm -hmm. And very sad. So, yes. so one of the chapters in there talks about writing your own story create your own story create your own narrative and my nephew was like you need to go on twitch and i was like i don't know it's not a video gaming thing and he was like you need to go on twitch and i was like finally i was like i am i am lifting you up i am motivating you to take charge yes and he did. yes absolutely so now i have a twitch account and oh Sweet. my goodness this one is pretty pretty solid Ooh, sorry about that Ugh. all right so this is my um peony and this is brand new. I just took the lid off. So we are going to stir, 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 and make sure we need to add water to it. You do want to stir first because sometimes our paste feels like it needs water, but once you've stirred it, it does not. But this does. I liked, somebody said, I saw it a little back. Somebody says they are so glad that they are watching us for the next 45 days, or at least oh, 40 some. Someone and was. somebody was also saying that this is now their uh, end of day thing. They come home. Get a cup of something hot, get in bed, and take notes on everything we're doing. Thanks Aww. for doing that. I hope you always learn something from us. Doo -doo -doo. So this peony, um, I am just making sure is nice and hydrated. Um, this had the tin foil on it, which means it's uh, a paste that has been... Can you get me some uh, what do you need? Uh, wipes? I'm all out. Oh, you're all out. Uh, the newer ones have kind of a plastic lid on it, which I don't have one. I'll have to show you. And because of this, um, I'm just making sure that this peony is nice and hydrated. If I showed up a little close, you'll see there's kind of like little lumps in there. Nothing to freak out about. We're just going to let it chillax with some distilled water as it rehydrates. If you have paste that is completely solid, um, there is tricks. Some people will heat it up. Some will let it sit in distilled water overnight. And Sean, why do we use distilled water? Because regular water is kind of almost, I hate to say the word contaminated, with all kinds of weird stuff in it. Uh, distilled water is very, um, not completely pure, but very pure. It's got all the, all the weird stuff taken out of it. So the other water would cause your mold and stuff to get in there. So mm -hmm. distilled water will keep that from happening. Yes. Good explanation, yeah. Jonathan. I would like to say that uh, Carol said, use puffy foam. It's actual foam from Sulky, and it uh, doesn't have a paper covering on it. Oh, maybe I can show you guys what... That would be kind of fun. Oh, do I not have... 
Oh, there it is. So let me see, this should have a new plastic lid on it. So this is reinforced. I'm actually all out almost. And this is what our new lids look like. So they have mm -hmm. a nice plastic top. They're not tin foil. They're much easier to see. Oh. Uh, another nice thing is our lids are plastic now. So we don't have to worry about a paper lid. Mm -hmm. Well, thanks Catherine for popping over into, uh, into good old um, Twitch. Was I the only person not on Twitch? Um, I don't know. I feel like I'm very old all of a sudden. <laughs> we are in the, what's called that we're under the uh, the category of, of art. Yeah. So hopefully some art, uh, artsy people are popping in to see what we're doing here. It's part of my blue ocean experiment, guys. Yes, absolutely. <laughs> so I'm taking all of my leftovers in here and just putting it in this container. Who else is in our room that's... Is that... Um, somebody is um, in... Is that um, talking for you? Maybe it's Ryan. Ryan or somebody, yeah. Because I know I didn't. I know I didn't do any of that. Do what? <laughs> no, it's oh, Jasmine. Oh, it's Jasmine and Sean commenting. So it's uh, Jasmine. Thanks, Jazzy. Jazzy's husband said we need to get on Twitch too. Yeah. See, all the cool kids are on Twitch, I guess. Thanks, Jazzy, for so popping in. I thought Twitch was mostly just for gamers, which I guess it is, but they do have an art division, and I figured Blue Ocean, Sean. Right? Yes. My son's golden birthday. So what is the golden birthday? I don't know. Mary Pat, what does that mean? She'll come back and see us later. But thanks. You may have to let us know what that means. Uh, Twitch mainly is for gaming, but it does have other categories. Like this one is art, um, podcasting, um, a few other ones. So I think more and more people are finding that uh, it's, a, it's an untapped and it uh, could be very good for a lot of people. So Blue Ocean. Blue Ocean. So we thought we would give it a give a whirl. But so everybody who is joining us, thank you, thank you. Normally I had this part done, but I was running a little late today and um, had some stuff on my to-do list and I got stuck in traffic. So I'm a little late, so mm. I apologize. This isn't the most exciting stuff, but you guys can see the amount of time I usually take beforehand to get things yes. ready. Um, I always tell people Chocotour is easy to use. You just want to make sure everything's prepped. So the worst thing is to be mid-design and realize your paste is too thick and you have to hurry up and add water or mm -hmm. something like that. Um, and usually at night, what you don't see is the hour afterwards cleaning up and making sure our paste is all clean and all that stuff. Okay, yeah. but that is finally all done. We are going to grab our surface. Golden uh, birthday is your 50th. There we go. And um, once again, if you are... Have any questions on Chalk Couture, let us know if you um, have heard about it but aren't working with the designer. We would love to be your designer and Sean is there to answer questions. For all you going over yes. to Twitch, thank you so yes. much because Ryan's given me yeah. all of these things I need to do. Kathy Case said she found us on Twitch. That's to wonderful. Be thank a you. Twitch thing. Yeah. And for those who haven't uh, been to Twitch, uh, our normal followers, here is the uh, link to get there. You can follow along. I'm not sure if you can do the Amazon yet. It, it may be, but they said just there's a way to get there and just follow. So once what we it actually you. become a channel, I think is how we yeah. get the Amazon. Sure. Right now we have to get to a certain requirements before yeah. we're considered a channel yeah. on Twitch. We're fall, and I think he called us. We're just follow a following group right now, and then we'll actually sure. then we'll be an actual channel, and then it'll be a lot we'll of different. We'll be a big it. boy. We'll be in the big boys. All right, so this is our new 18 inch by 18 inch Sylvie frame, which is perfect because it fits our D size transfers perfectly. Now I am gonna start keeping the corners on my frames. Normally I would take these off, but because we do sell a lot of our artwork after the fact, we're gonna keep those on so it protects mm -hmm. the frames. Yes. You're gonna grab our fuzzing cloth. So the fuzzing cloth is a key on a new transfer. This is a brand new transfer, never opened it. And this is key because our transfers are intentionally sticky because yeah. per corporate, they should last eight to 12 times. However, if you take care of them, they should last a lot longer. A golden birthday is also known on the day, let's say you were born on the sixth, so your sixth birthday was your golden. Oh. So mine, believe it or not, is the same as Barb's. Barb, you and I are kindred spirits. I was born March 11th as well. Thank you. So what would then September, like if someone that was turning nine on September 9th. Ooh, that'd be that's crazy. That's like a double golden that would be birthday a, or something. That might be a platinum. 
Okay, guys, so I'm going to tell you, I do have a sped up version showing this, but there is many different ways that you can do a one and done project like this. So I call them one and done, meaning it's one layer. We're not going to be doing multiple layers, but something like this can be either the easiest project around or it can be a tough project because if yeah. you're doing it all in one color, like this one, Show me this one all with white, mm -hmm. and this takes 30 seconds. Yeah, it, it's, it's just... It's literally white. I just place it on four inch, boom, boom, within, as soon as it's done okay, and off, gorgeous. it's great. Isn't, don't you love this that? This is where Chocotour, in my opinion, just really... Shine, shine, shine. Shine, shine, shine. Yeah, it's awesome. Having that in your, uh, somewhere in your hallway or in, at the end of a hallway, maybe, mm -hmm. or just somewhere in a beautiful room. Yeah. Wouldn't that be nice? So uh, there's many different things. You can keep your, you can move really fast. You can put moisture back on it. Mm -hmm. um, you can reapply it, but we're gonna be doing what's called the paste and pull method. And we'll show you what that is here. Fatima, thank you for uh, putting that little info out on how to uh, get to Amazon stuff, thanks. Oh, Wendy, thank you. We have, we're we uh, birthday twins too, same day as mine. Sweet. How much for that Paris pick? <laughs> it will be going up in it'll our It'll be auction. going, yes, it'll be going up and up in Sean auction. Sean actually did that one um, for one of our sped up videos. Yeah, so once we do our auction, uh, highest bidder wins. Okay, so the big key on uh, when you're doing what I call one and done is number one, you want to make sure that you fuzz, of course. Number two, you want to have your paste ready to go. And most importantly, you want to make sure there's no ripples or bubbles. Mm -hmm. So I'm just running my hand over and what we're looking for is, especially where there is open spots, anywhere you see black is where the silk screen technically is with the adhesive behind it. Mm -hmm. So the great thing about Chocotour is you get this nice, um, finished result. Uh, this one we're going to do, like I said, the paste and pull. Yeah, this way you can do, you can see how hard this would be if you were to do multiple colors and try to get it all off at once. There's just too much going on, but by mm -hmm. doing this paste and pull, it's much easier to do. So break out your, uh, your pens and pencils and watch how we do this. Why would they need their pens and pencils? Some people like to take notes. Oh, I see. Yeah, one of our one of our people said that's what they're doing right oh, now. They like gotcha. to watch this and take notes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Sean, what am I going to do with you? Okay, so we're going to start with white, red. Um, Vicky said she did this transfer on a T-shirt. Ooh, really? That looked oh, amazing. I bet you it would have. Oh, you need to wash those hands. I do. I will do that. Thank you. You're welcome. So I'm going to open up all of my colors here. Mm -hmm. um, you can wash it off the end because I'll probably put stuff in it for now. Okay. Um, so what I do is I just put my paste over to my side. I do take the extra time, you guys, to get really organized before doing a paste and pull. You'll see in Chocotour's videos, they do the same thing. They have their little uh, paste ready to go. And you just want to make sure you give yourself the time and everything. So... Um, all of these little stars and stuff are silver, so we also um, are going to be doing silver. Now, I am going to let you know, silver will be the last thing I do because I am going to be adding glitter. So that will be, even though this is a paste and pull, that will be one of the last things that I apply to this transfer. Okay, so I'm going to start with my white. And I would say one of the big things that I always tell people, especially on this, is... You know what, maybe I'll just follow down the color with the stars, or do you think the stars should all be one color? The stars? Probably just one color. You think so? Oh, Desiree, or white? so sorry for your loss of your your fur baby. Oh. We know how it goes. It's it's sad, 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 sad. We don't like going through that. No, we do not. Hi, Sally. No sound. I'm, I think there is sound on Twitch because everybody's been commenting and not had said anything. So, sorry. Yay, glitter. Oh, that's kind of cool. <laughs> what? Uh, there's a little um, thing that uh, Fatima did on Twitch. See, it says yippee and then a yay circle. Glitter. 
Yeah, that's what's kind of cool about Twitch is they have a little bit more options. So a lot of options. what yeah. I always do, guys, is and gals, is I will put it on thick enough to where you should not see um, the transfer underneath of it. And the reason we do this is as soon as you put down your paste, it's already starting to dry. And normally this is not an issue because we are not um, worried too much about the paste drying because usually it's quick little applications. But on one like this, this is where paste and pull becomes important because uh, we are going to finish basically the first three lines, pull it up, dry it, set it back down. Um, so take your time. I know that everyone's always rush, rush, rush. We don't want our paste to dry. But as long as you put it on thick and remove it at the end, we should be okay. And if not, guess what? What's There's that? ways to fix it. Jackie Rose, hello. Johnny Lee, what the heck is Twitch? Twitch is another uh, streaming platform like, you know, Facebook, YouTube. A lot of gamers use it. It's, it's huge in gaming, but there are a lot of other platforms on, um, or other sections of Twitch, uh, political. Um, there's a political section? Yeah, there's political in there oh. too. They do, um, this one is art. Another one we did uh, uh, earlier today when we did Ken for the Car, we did uh, the uh, chat talk or something like that where we just, because we're just chatting about, they do podcasts from there as well. Also, all kinds of things. So it's kind of cool. Ah, my favorite men. Thank you, Sharon. You're so kind. Hi, Miss Garcia. Welcome. Arts and crafts, yeah. Thank you, uh, Jazzy. So I am leaving all of those kind of stars and things until the end. We will do a second application on that. Um, we'll line it up and everything, and that way we don't have to worry about trying to do glitter in between each one because that would be kind of no fun. Yeah. No bueno. Yeah, you bet, Johnny. No problem. <clears throat> All right, so we're just going to end right here. And what we're going to do now is grab clean squeegees. These are our mini squeegees, which give us a little bit of um, an area to work in here. So, um, and now I'm going to go backwards, starting with my white. Since there are uh, a few newbies that have not seen any of this before, let me give you the lowdown while he's doing that. So the mini is about uh, maybe a fourth of the small squeegee and then the long one is called our multi-tool. It uh, can be used for multiple things from stirring or uh, trying to chalk into tiny little places. The hockey stick end, as you can see, oh, is great squeegee. for, oh, I'm sorry, is great for uh, cleaning your oh, jar no, lids okay. and insides. So uh, that's why they call it the multi-tool. It's very solid in the middle and very flimsy silicone on the outer end, so it bends really nice. So even though I put a lot of water in this evergreen, it's still pretty thick. So I'm going to leave, leave that on actually and take that one off last um, because it's still pretty decently hydrated that way. I'm going to remove my red, which I can move a little bit faster because it's a little bit of an open space up here. Mm -hmm. Hi, Dina. I still like we need music. I know, right? <laughs> just, just a little bit in the background. Almost like, like if you're when you're in the uh, department store and you hear that music, just kinda, yes. Wait, it just can't be anything that is copyrighted. <laughs> no, they'll get you. They'll get you, and then you take your monetization away. All right, so now all we're going to do is lift this up. Hey, Lisa. Like so. And mm -hmm. then I'll have Sean. You don't. You can leave it like this, but we're going to have Sean.
great things about the paste and pull is if you missed out on a certain spot or you notice you got red and stuff, we can lay it right back down and hit those spots again. So that's what's kind of nice is like I noticed as soon as I lifted up, oh, I got a little bit of a white trail there. So I'm just gonna go right back over that like so. We can grab another thing of a big one here and You've got that correct there, Fatima. Perfectly well said. Triple P's in the room. Hello. And I did forget a little bit up here on my apostrophe. We're just going to make sure that that's good and done. I'm always super nervous when I do white and red, and that's the reason why is I had a little speck of red that I'm gonna have to now touch up that went into my white, and it's because the side of my jar got a little contaminated. Little contamination station. It happens. All right, I'm gonna have Sean blow dry this again real quick. Oh, you know what? I pulled up. I shouldn't have done that. That's my white fault. Okay, so what we're gonna do, yep, go ahead, gonna, can you go clean that? I can. So let me tell you what I did wrong here. <laughs> um, my white always pulls up, but here's the great news about chalk tour, is mistakes are easy as one, two, three. You can just erase it and start over. And we now know, I forgot my white will pull up on me all the time. I should have known that, you guys. We'll edit that out in post. Restart. While Sean's cleaning that, I'm going to add some more to my green. My green is very dry. There we go. Thank you, Sean. Yep. So let's Sorry. take two. Sorry about that noise. What noise? Oh, I left my mic on. Oh, you on. did your... Left my mic on. All right, so I'm going to have Sean put this. When you clean a transfer... <laughs> I know, turn off your mic. I always yeah, tell no. them that. Sorry. I meant to. So when you clean a transfer, um, I just basically put it uh, wet side down, and then I'm just going to squeegee out the water. You can use a four inch squeegee, but our buzzing cloths do just the trick. Once you're done with that, lift it up, just like so. And then we're gonna put it sticky side up this time. Hey, Don. And like so. We don't use those cloths very often, Robin. What cloths? These. The only time I use these cloths is um, if I'm trying to get a board dry really fast. So our fuzzing cloth does a great job fuzzing. The one feedback I've given is it doesn't absorb water as fast as I would like it to. So I still, I won't lie, I still use those to absorb water quickly. Mm -hmm. Celia says, do the white last. I know, I need to do the white last. I know, I know, I know. Dottie from Nova Scotia. Yay. Nova Scotia. 
means get new, out of here. means New Scotland. That's crazy. All right, so I do have a little bit of. This happens a lot actually on Sylvie board, so I'm glad I can show you this. So our red will stain our boards, and you see that right here, which is not a big deal. All you need to do is get one of our board erasers, a little wet. Just like so. Gone. And it's gone. Gonzo's. Hey, Catherine, or Kathleen, sorry. I can't read too well. No, he was thinking that uh, sauce today was hot, and then he realized it said serve heat, hot. Heat and serve. <laughs> it's gonna be heat. I thought it said like heat and sweet. Oh, yeah. Sean, you my, make my life my so left much con happier. My left contact is for reading, but it doesn't, it sometimes fails me. Sometimes it fails. It fails. All right, so. That's what I love about Chocotour. Had this been, let's say, a vinyl project, I would be recutting it and screaming at myself. Mm-hmm. Nope, no, nothing against vinyl, I just... No, nope, nothing really against it. That's not center where I want it. Oh, well, hi, Tisha. I feel so bad for our UPS guy lately because all my club couture <laughs> orders are coming in and there's many times they'll sit there and say, what do you guys do? <laughs> Why are so many boxes coming uh, in? And Don said, or say, not Don, it's, um, here we go. Uh, Rebecca says she left for a moment and came back and the board's now blank. What happened? <laughs> we had an oopsie dooley. And now I am fixing it. It's, this is easier than trying to fix it. So that's what's great. Well, and uh, to be honest, you could fix it, but it is easier and you'll get a better consistent result. Okay, so we're gonna start with the red and we're gonna do white last because my white does dry pretty fast. Yeah. Unsure why. I don't know, because other people don't have that issue. I actually brought that up one time at a Chocotour event and I was like, okay, can we talk about our white? always pulling up and people are like, ours doesn't do that. And I was like, what? What am I doing wrong? And then other people were like, oh no, I have the same issue. So I don't know if it's just, I don't know. I do not know. I just know that mine has issues sometimes. Well, that's an interesting uh, YouTube name. Before the stroke of my pen too. Oh, I like that. That's cool. That's very cool. Hi, Missy. Okay. We're going to now put some green on the tree. Man, this green is still pretty thick, but that's okay. You know, uh, Jazzy, it does look pretty cool on Twitch, doesn't it? And it's not even that um, delayed. Well, it is a streaming platform, so mm -hmm. maybe they've worked out kind of those those things. Let me see how far off you are. Sean loves to see how far we're off on, on streaming stuff. It's like his mojo. He loves it. He's always like... It's 11 seconds behind. Pretty good. So direction of your squeegee can make or break you. So I always tell people cut into small words like this. And what I mean by that is put your squeegee angle side down and you'll have a little bit more control. You can also grab the multi-tool um, and just go slow on ones that are this close. You make it look so easy. Oh, I'm sweating through this whole thing, guys. I'm just kidding.
I think the reason why it messed up is Sean had to say, we do works of art on this channel. We make perfection pieces. <laughs> and he jinxed me. <laughs> can you go clean that one? I accidentally contaminated sure, my white and my red. I'm sure, so sorry, I'm Sean. Not. No problema. All right, so let's go ahead and remove my red first. Okay. I see where my contamination happened, so I'm having Sean take care of it so I don't run into that same issue again. Because red and white contamination station. I can't wait to show you guys our first attempts at Chalk Couture because I'm telling you, it's rough. And there's days where it is rough. There's days where I... I will tell you, there is one transfer out of the Holiday Suite catalog that I have given up on. I don't know what I'm doing wrong. I'm not going to tell you which one it is. You guys can guess. But no matter what I do on this one transfer, Sean's tried it. I've tried it. I cannot get it to work. That one transfer we have tried a bazillion and a half times. Oh, I know. Just like and I don't know what I'm doing wrong. I don't know if I'm running too fast. So I went on the designer studio to see if I got any help and I don't think I have actually seen anyone oh. what happened I did uh. the cardinal rule of going left to right instead of up to down so the good news is is we can make that look festive how when in doubt add a little green and red and it'll look like candy stripes mm-hmm this is how Ken makes when people are like, oh, I would have never thought to do this. And then I say, me either. But when you have a mistake, you think of things really quick. <laughs> Isn't that right, Sean? Yes. So Miss, let's see. Miss Jazzy says, guys, we've officially, we've completed a build a community. Now we can recognize viewers as VIPs. Not sure what that is, but it's cool. That is cool. Sweet. I don't know what that that's is on, either. It's on Twitch, yeah. I think the number of people that have, um, probably that have. All right, Sean, yeah. you ready? Jen says she needs a Sean too. Okay, here we go. Straight up. Oh, oh that was cool. Oh, I like it. Oh, my God. It was meant to happen. Yeah. We want this nice and dry. Can you maybe move the uh, picture to the lower third for a while? Oh, you don't even have it. I, I, yeah, because it was kind of in the way. It should be dry. Look at that, you guys. So our little oopsie dooley. We'll get it closer here in a second, but yeah. kind of made it look nice. Yeah. Okay, so when you lay down a paste and pull, you are going to push back down any part of your transfer you might have pulled up that we need to push down because this will make sure you don't have any bubbles in it. So just like that, and we're good to go. All right, so we're going to do some stuff in sil uh You know what? Instead of doing glitter, I might do shimmer paste. Let's try shimmer paste. I never use my shimmer. Somebody was just talking about uh, shimmer paste or the glitter paste. That's another name for it. Um, the only thing about using Where it. Where's my it, silver? There it is. Is that you need to make sure you're really pressing through uh, onto your um, transfer itself because the glitter like the, or the shimmering material that's in there is, likes to stay on top. So as long as you get it really down in there, it should uh, should be just fine. And people, I think, get confused. It's not a glitter it's paste. Not. It's a shimmer. Yeah. So you're going to have a completely different effect than you would have on. So, but this is okay. I think we'll do this instead of glitter because I'm liking it. So we're going to do the house green. And then, so this is going to be glitter green. And then was stirring is going to be white. So shimmer, green, white. So we're going to start with my green. I am going to check it because my green has been drying up pretty quick, you guys. And you can already tell that's pretty thick. Yeah. 
Cat Robbie says, sometimes mistakes makes the most beautiful finished projects. So true. So true. That's what my mom said when I was born. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> I was supposed to be a girl and she got half of her, I mean, she got half her wish. I was going to be named Rose, which is interesting because now my niece is named Rose. Yeah. Milady Jax from Twitch says, congratulations, KK team. Okay. So, oh, thank you. I don't know what we're congratulating me on, but thanks. I think because you're now, oops, what did I do? Oh, everyone's gone now. Bye, everyone. Uh, what did you do? What did you hit? Nothing. I was just scrolling. Oh, it's just your... your... Yeah, you're yeah, fine. I'm you're sorry. fine, Sean. I lost all the uh, chat, so give me a second to have it pop in there again. So if you said something or oh, asked hi. something, sorry. We so I'm going to do my there green up here. This is the rainforest green, so I haven't use this a lot i.e that's another hint for you of the transfer that's been giving me a problem the reason we've gone through so much rainforest is because of the transfer that is giving wow. me a headache yeah look how clear that is on on twitch that's it we're only gonna be on twitch now guys sorry I'm ah, looks really good so now you guys can all guess what transfer has been giving ken and sean we've tried it five six times in videos and i've given up every time so i don't know what i'm doing wrong but it is something so according to what Miss Jasmine's saying and the other ones is that they, the girls are, are now uh, princesses. They get to wear crowns. Oh, that's fun. Canterbury. Oh, Canterbury. Sorry about that. Oh, it's your name in the gaming community. I did not know that, Amanda. Oh, I want to play. I, see, I need to be a gamer, but I don't have time to be a gamer. Yeah. My, our our nephew is a major gamer. Hence why he wants us on Twitch. Yeah. He uh, wins all of his tournaments all the time. He wants to go pro. Ken, you're a loser. What do you win? But it's what hard have to you go, won lately, Ken? Hard to go pro when you got a baby. <laughs> okay, so we are going to finish with some nice white here on was stirring we're going to try to be very diligent not to touchy the green because that would make it a lime green nothing bad but don't want that kathy says you should check out the twitch app the image is so crystal clear it looks like it's in high def what have you seen it look at do it. do i look skinny on it that's all i care about look how clear look how clear that is wow that is nice that is nice this is might be a good thing ryan yeah, because ryan. everyone always says i wish i could see your um, boards in high def, so this is good. Good, good, good. I think um, YouTube and Facebook downgrade the stream quality. He needs to give us Twitch uh, tips. Yes, he does. We'll have to ask him tomorrow. Who? Ryan. Who wants tips? Fatima just said that. Oh, cool. I love that idea. Yeah. All right, so we have all of my color down. I'm going to end with my white, so we're going to... Start with the green. My son's a gamer too, and he's twelve. And that's about what the about how old uh, Ryan was when he started. He was about twelve. He started with cute games like Mario and Mario Kart, and then he got into the games where he murders everyone. <laughs> <laughs> and that's all there is now. I feel like. Okay, so we are going to now grab my... Oh, thanks for dropping in there, Miss Jasmine. Thank you, Jazzy. Have a good night. See you tomorrow. See you manana. Yeah, he can't wait for... Um... Oh, which one is coming out next this Friday? Call of Duty. Call of Duty. Yeah, he can't wait. I thought he could wait. I thought he wasn't that excited about it. No, he can't wait. It's, it's like his game. Oh, it is? Yep. Did can't he wait. Like, did he invent it? No, it's just... Then how is it his game? It's his game that he loves to play. That's oh. what I mean. Here's your white, by the way. Okay, guys, I'm going to remove my white, so I'm checking my fingers, make sure I don't have anything on there, because even though we like that finished result of what we have, I don't want, want some just basic white. My kiddo is 12, and he's a Fortnite. Fortnite, I think I get, but I don't. Minecraft is what they used to go around and build used stuff be, in little QB people. But I don't understand what Fortnite is. Isn't Fortnite like Minecraft, but a little different? It's a lot. I think it's a lot better. And I, I don't know if you if it's a shooting game or not. It could be, but... I don't get it. But I also didn't get Minecraft for the longest time, so... Yeah. I remember my nephew was the cutie patootie and was, like, building stuff with it. Like, he had yeah. his own, like, Disney World, I think. Yeah, something. he did. 
I like Mario, Kathleen says. Mario is a classic. You can't go wrong with Mario. Mm -hmm. So here's the next pull and paste and pull. Now we're going to dry it. like our shimmer paste yeah. I think people get get upset because they think it's gonna be more glitter and it's not it's shimmer yes. you know I don't think people get upset I think people go in thinking it's gonna be glitter and when it's more shimmer they're like oh okay so we are now going to push the stamp yeah the silver does look pretty cool in that doesn't it or Annette, is that a net? Yeah, a net. Uh, sorry, a net. Uh. Okay, so this one is we are going to bring in some new colors. Well, one new color, and that's peony. Um, I'm following what was in the uh, recipe guide, and at first I was like, oh, I don't like it. But now that I see the peony next to everything, mm -hmm. I really like it. Really Just fun. that that pop of color with mouse. So we are going to follow that. So the colors we're going to do here is not even as green. A mouse is peony, the stockings were hung as red, and then this is green, and then all of, down here is some other colors. So I think I'm going to start with my green and green. I'm actually going to do not even a mouse, not even blistering, not even a mouse, the stockings. So I think that's why that's red. I see. Not even a mouse. So this is green, pink, gray. Green, pink, gray. Green, pink, gray, green, pink, gray, green, pink, gray. So we can't wait for, um, to see what it will all look like once we get our, um, fiber. fiber. Um, we're getting, he's not talking about fiber you eat. No, this is the, uh, fiber network. Uh, that uh, CenturyLink is putting in. They're they're stringing it right now across the back way here and stuff. So eventually we'll get that. And this will be a 940 megs download with a, I think 800 megs upload I don't know. speed. I don't know what that means, but every time Sean talks about it, he is more turned on by that than ever me. <laughs> he's like, he tells everyone, he's like, guess what? Guess what? He even told the Comcast guy that came by to fix our stuff. He's like, we're getting fiber, not with you. <laughs> I was like, okay, Sean. You don't have to be mean to the fiber guy or the Comcast guy. But to his point, we pay a lot for our oh, it's, Comcast. Oh, it's horrible. And we do not get consistent. Even though we're on a business line, which we had to just to get the better upload speed, but they're, according to them, the th this speed that they're expecting to give us is only 65 bucks a month. Mm-hmm. We'll see, I guess. It's always what they say in the beginning. And it's only going to cost you $65 a month. And then in six months you call and they're like, mm, yeah, that was an introductory offer. And you're like, wait a minute. <laughs> wait a hot sec minute, people. Okay, so the mouse is a cutie patootie gray, the shimmer silver. You can get to Ikea in an hour and 25 minutes. God, I wish. Ours is four hours. Yeah, away. More than that. Ours is five hours. We took jamming, jamming. Jasmine. We took Jasmine to her first Ikea experience. Mm. Yeah, ours is five hours away. Okay, I am going to just remove this line because I already have three colors and that's enough for me to deal with. And then we will dry it and then we'll do the next couple layers. So the nice thing, I mean, the paste and pull, you could wash it. The thing on the paste and pull, the reason I don't wash it and do multiple layers is what you saw with my white. That consistently happens. You know what's so funny is we've been with Chalk Tour so long that I don't know what I would think if I was just scrolling the internet and saw it for the first time. Like, because it definitely is pretty much what we saw the first time, but a lot different too, mm -hmm. if that makes any sense. Kara says she's never been to Ikea. If you ever get to, do it. Do it right now. Yeah. Drop everything. I do have to say it's a religious experience almost. Are you ready, Shawnee? Yeah, I'm ready. Let me hold that for you. 
<clears throat> Fatima says she's only seven minutes away from uh, okay, now we're Ikea. Yeah, everyone. I know. <laughs> oh, cool. Here we go. <laughs> Oh, I'm sorry. You're hitting my transfer with your cord. So I was trying to get okay. it out of the way. Okay. I'm um, going to check my fingers. Okay. And then once again, guys, once you checked your fingers and they're good, you're going to push down those letters again. So you do not have ripples. The number one mistake I make is I forget this step. I go to put my paste and I realize my transfer is not on there 100% mm -hmm. and it ends up having like a ripple or a wrinkle. Um, so take the time, just do that. You'll be and you saw glad this. you did. You saw this part, right? Um, I did. I was hoping not everyone else did, but thank okay. you, Sean, for pointing it out to everyone. I wouldn't. I didn't you say are anything. awesome. Nobody can see anything. Well, now they're all looking. What is he pointing to? Did yeah. What is he seeing that I'm not seeing? What <laughs> did he do wrong? Nothing. You got to love it when someone does that. You did see this mistake, Kenny. Kenny, did you see this mistake you made right here? Did you see that? You did see this mistake, right? But yes, I did see it, Sean, and I will show them how to fix it. But thank you for always pointing out my mistakes for me. You keep me. You 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 make sure I'm real. Carol, you, you can still do this. All you, all you have to do is pull back your, uh, when you're by yourself, pull it back and you can let it oh, sit yeah. on something, dry, and then put it back down. Really, the paste dries super quick and once it's dry, it won't, yeah. you don't have to worry about it. But um, there's many times I don't have Sean here and I do it. I will say the reason why I'll have him do it while we do it live is um normally i would be over it and you wouldn't see it at all so this way you guys can see what we're doing while we do it mm -hmm. yeah our ikea is in seattle which is four and a half hours away but then you have to go to tukwila which is another 30 minutes down that's why it takes five hours to get there but we do it from time to time i am going to have a little fun here and we are going to do another stripe look here yeah that turned out really cool yeah, so I'm purposely going to get it contaminated here in just a sec to match up above. So the way I do that stripe look, pretty easy, guys. Um, so we are going to put this white all the way down. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. So now what we can do is grab just a little bit of red. And every once in a while, just kind of put the red. Hmm. We've had 14 messages that have been deleted by the well, moderator. Hopefully they're good. They were bad messages and we're not deleting other people's. That would be hilarious. Yeah, they, it, I think it's all bad words. If any bad words come up, it automatically does um, it. Twitch has a lot. That's one thing I'm noticing and I'm not saying it's a bad thing, but it does seem like Twitch does have a lot of Kind of reminded us of uh, Periscope. Periscope. Periscope was the same way. Headed to IKEA for, for on Friday for new shelves for the kiddos' room. Perfect. I love IKEA. I wish we had a closer one. Yeah. All right, and I am going to add a little, just to add a little flair, a little bit of this peony. Why not? Carol, that is true. You can do online for IKEA, but shipping's a little much. Yep, we looked into it, believe me. We looked at all the stuff that we bought last time. It, it would have ended up being over two hundred dollars in shipping. Mm -hmm. And it's only a four hour like I said, like a five hour five hour drive. It's like, oh moly. Mole, 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 mole. Yeah, the Seattle one is is closer than Portland. Portland just takes six hours, period, just to get into the outskirts. But Seattle is new. Is Portland new now? I think it is, actually, yeah. Does, yeah, yeah, Seattle built a new one just, what, two years ago? Yeah, I thought. I don't even yeah. think it was that long ago. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to start by taking off my red. Just 
Jen Selfridge, newbie here. Do you have to be concerned about the chalk drying on the transfer? You do, Jen. This is why we are doing what's called a paste and peel. We're only doing s small sections. If we were to do this, now if we were to do this all in one color, no problem. But because you are doing multiple colors, you do need to have the time to do a paste and pull in sections. Um, uh, since you're new, what he's doing is that the, the sections he first started off with are thick. They're on there really thick so that it stays um, more wet underneath while the, just the surface dries. And then he can go back. He does the, the first one will always be the last one to pull. And since this is all mixed up with white and different colors, we're just going to throw this all in a baby wipe. Some people find this a little bit of maybe uh, wasteful, but it's okay. It looks so good and beautiful when you do this. Valerie, you're right. Portland, last time I drove to Portland, it was horrendous. Horrendous. Okay, we're going to pull and dry this la this almost last piece. Look at that. Oh, that sucks so cool. Can you pull your sock just a little more? There you go. So the bottom here we have in hopes that St. Nicholas soon would be there and I'm going to be using my silver and um, we'll do white here. So we're going to start with the white in hopes. Um, Kathy, Tom's, the lag, it looked like it was about 11 seconds uh, last time I checked on Twitch. Let me see what it is now. As soon as I see him do something, I can count. So when he starts this next color, I can actually count. Ten seconds now. We're up to ten second lag only. It's pretty good. That's actually really good. Usually, especially by because we're going through a third party switcher, um, it usually like on uh, YouTube or Facebook, it's almost thirty seconds in lag time. That's another nice thing about Twitch. It's much less of a lag. I like it. Uh, yes, Caterbury, uh, there was something that says, stop spamming em emotes, warning. Hmm, weird. Well, and that could be from that, that bot we're using. Yes, I, We're getting is. used to Twitch, so. Yeah, so our first one, we had some not so nice things being, uh, said on our thing, so we went ahead and, um... Ryan says he's got this thing to go ahead and use and because there was some not nice things. Tennessee Jenny, hello Miss Killian. I posted that I think it's the classic Christmas tree transfer. Dying to know if, if that's it. All right, I'm going to dry this part so a little noise, guys.
Michelle, you've asked a question. Oh, I won't let you ask it. Ugh, that's kind of weird. What could it be? What could it be? This board is gorgeous, isn't it? Is there a star on top of the tree? There is not one on there, no. I'll give you guys some uh, close-ups here. I'm gonna just zoom in here a little bit. Um, let me do this real quick. So you can see the word house is a little different. And this is the one that's got it. If, if you look at it at certain angles, in kind of, it's a little hard on the uh, on TV and on the thing, but it's got a little shine to it. And you can see that uh, that really cool where we did the the hot mess, the green and white and red. All right, guys. So I'm gonna fix a few little uh, mistakes that I noticed. Nothing huge, nope. but some, um, so that you guys can see kind of how I fix them. So the number one thing I have, I'm gonna start with, is I'm gonna take a, I call a pokey tool, which is something like this, okay? And see on that L right there, there's a little bit of it sticking out. You can take your pokey tool, Just like so. Excuse me, Sean. Mm -hmm. You can do picture in picture too if you want to get. Yeah, you sure. Um, and then just take canned air, just like that. So, um, you can go around your entire thing and see if any of those, like down here on my S, I have a little bit of it. Now you want to make sure your board is dry. You do not want to do this with wet paste. And I would use caution doing it on an Aiden board. Our Aiden boards have a finish to them, or yeah, a, a porcelain. porcelain finish, and it could scratch it where this has what we call our boutique finish, which is a little bit more of a, uh, has a finish on top of it, which will, okay, so that's the first one. The next thing we're gonna do is grab a paintbrush. So, I have gotten so many comments on how I paint, but I do grab a fine tip paintbrush. These are from Arteza. You can see how tip they are. And I do lick them. And the reason why is not because I like the taste of them, <laughs> but um, by doing that, it makes it a very nice and stiff point on the end. So I can go into, for example, this S right here. There's, let me have Sean zoom in so you can see what I'm fixing here. Where are you? Where right are you here. Doing it? Oh, right there. Okay. Got it. So you can see right here, there's a little oh, bit is. of the paste nicked. So I'm just going to take this. Dip it in my red paste yep. and just very gently fix that and you won't even be able to tell. So we're gonna do that anywhere where we see a break in the paste. Now you do not have to do this if you like that vintage -y feel, but in this case, I know these areas of my transfer were not vintage. You might wanna zoom back out. Okay. Yeah, I'll talk to um, Ryan about uh, getting Nightbot to. What is it doing? He says it might be on. It's on a very high end. It's yeah, causing, and it's, it's probably the same thing. Like on, I used to have a bot version on another channel, and it wouldn't let people comment more than like three times, and yeah. it put them in timeout. Yeah, that's what somebody else said. So we'll fix that for you guys. Yeah, it's our only our, our first, first time. First day. So I'm just gonna go through. Oh yeah, me, needs to move the alert from the middle of the screen. Is it still there? What alert? This alert here. Oh, see, yeah. Uh, I'm that's not sure. Every it, time someone's following, he needs to. Yeah, we need to get rid of that. Not sure how to make that go away. So the good news is, guys, is he's here tomorrow, and I will fix that for you. Yeah. We'll get all that worked out for you. But we'd like to say thank you, everybody that has new to us and seen this for the first time for joining us. Boy, that so I, I could, yeah, that definitely is high def. I can really see all your hair, <laughs> your hair strands. 
So this wow. one here, I can tell you what my issue was. When I went to go lay it back down, um, I touched the transfer and lifted up before Sean hit it, and I was trying to get out of his way. And by doing that, it, you can see what it clearly did is it touched the paste and lifted it up. Yeah, those candy stripes are perfect, aren't they? Are they cool? All right. Oh, perfect. Perfect. And now we are going to do the same with our white. I only have a few areas that I want to fix. So right here in the H, you can see I lifted up too much and we have a little bit of a There we go. And other than that, I think we're good on the way. All right, I think. Mm -hmm. Oh, thanks, thanks more. Yeah. yeah. We'll have one more thing I want to do. So the last thing I want to do is grab my white chalkable marker and a paintbrush to add a little bit of pink up through here to draw it in. So we're gonna grab first the chalkable marker. These are literally um, just white chalk. And I'm gonna clean this one. It's got a little bit of blue residue on it from something. Yep. Yes, for all those who are wondering, once we get our, what they call a sub button or a subscribe button, once we get that, then you can uh, use your, um, if you're an Amazon Prime person, you can join and subscribe to our channel on Twitch for free. But there are restrictions on where he can stream. I don't think we're gonna stream very, very many places. <laughs> what was that? She says that once you, when that does happen, uh, there are restrictions on where he can stream. I don't know what that means. I don't know either. We'll ask. Thanks, Diana. Okay, the last thing I'm gonna grab is a pointy black, and this does kind of big dollops. And what we're doing is basically just making some big pink dollops on the board. And the reason I'm doing this is to incorporate that little bit of the pink in the mouse so it's not looking like it's just this lone wolf. So we can have a little bit more pink throughout. And I think by doing that candy stripe, it automatically brings in the pink because it has a little bit of pink in there. Uh, Cadbury, we are actually streaming to Twitch, Facebook, and YouTube all at the same time using Restream. All right, I think we're done. What do you guys think? What do you think, Sean? I love this, this is absolutely amazing. You can go ahead and do a, oh, the last thing I was gonna show you guys. Um, do you wanna dry it real quick? I'm gonna go wash these lids yes, and I'm then I'll do show some the last thing I was gonna do. Thanks everybody, Jen and Pat, thank you so much. So true, DSL is a joke. So last thing we're doing, Sean, will you show them in the back there is the two hangers. Mm -hmm. So it's not a single hook, it actually has two hooks, which is actually kind of fun because we can add, can you put it upside down real quick? Or? I'll put it sideways this way. Yeah. So we're gonna actually take ribbon 
And this is just a red buff or a white and black buffalo plaid. And we're just going to tie it on there. Tie it on there. Just like so. Get enough of it to where you want it. So this is going to be more of a statement when you hang it. It's not going to be, um, what I mean is you're not trying to hide the wire like you normally mm -hmm. would. You want to show it off. So we're going to then put this down here. Trim it up. So it's not a huge deal, but it does add just a little bit of finish on the top a little of the country, board. A little country yeah. charm. So we can go Good to this one. one to show you. So when you hang it on the wall, you got this nice black and white string here. Like I said, it's nothing huge, but it does. It adds just that little bit of charm. Cecilia, yes. Uh, once we do all of our artwork, um, we always sign the back. We do. Yep. That is true. We do sign up. We both sign it. All right, guys. So that is it. What do you guys think? You like it? I think everybody's loving it. Looks lovely. Actually, gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. I have, to imagine, I have to admit, this was a happy little mistake. Can you go back to the overhead view? Totally, shiny? totally copying the stripes and everything. So I, I love the way that this worked. So mm -hmm. this is more of a hot mess look where you have the red and the green, where Messy. this has more of that stripe green, red, and pink. So I love the mouse being prominently displayed. Mm -hmm. um, I am very happy with Karen says you just got this board, nice. Okay, so to answer the question, the question was, what is the one transfer Sean and I cannot get to work and why have we gone through so much rainforest and why so? Which one was it? In anticipation. Drum roll, please. Oh, this one. Oh, Drum. it's a pain in the butt. Yes, this one has been an Not absolutely fun. horror. And I, I figured out what I'm doing wrong. Um, we need to do the paste and pull going down. What we're trying to do is do the green, pull it, dry it, re yellow, and it's pulling yeah, up. I think we so, truly just do it in sections. We have tried it six times, and all of this greenery is. We did in rainforest. We went through a whole can of rainforest. A jar of it. So yeah. whoever guessed that, you are correct. Yes, it was the tree. Yes, it was the tree. And oh, Sean finally came is out. Is that called Oh Christmas Tree? No, that one's called Vin uh, not Vintage Tree. It's called Classic Christmas. Classic Tree. tree. So those who uh, chose Classic Tree, that's so um, Sean came up to me. And he goes, I just you can go back up to us. He goes, I just don't know what I'm doing wrong. And I said, I thought I was mean? doing, and I thought I was doing such a good job to it. And too. I was like, I'm like. Oh, Sean, let me just go do it for you. And I did the first one and I go, dang it. Did the second one, what is wrong? And he kind of looked at me and he didn't and say anything. And he did, you did, it, and he did it slightly different too than what I was yeah, doing. Yeah, and I finally said to him, I said, this transfer's broken. <laughs> and we erased the video and I said, we will never speak of this. <laughs> and yeah, here we are speaking, are of, it. But, speaking of it. Um, there are some times where you just get into the, we get our blinders on of thinking, this is how we've always done it, so. Oh, can't ask questions in in caps with Nightbot. Oh, uh, interesting. Yeah, we'll definitely ask, uh, yeah, so if you need to ask a question, just use normal. Yeah. Sorry, it's so new to us, guys. Yeah, we are we figuring have, it out, but. Even Nightbot's new to us. I am trying it because I want to go where no Choc Couture has gone before. Yeah. I also am thinking of a segment called, Can We Chalk on That? Oh, yeah. Where we find random stuff and see if we can chalk on it. And I had the, the idea because yesterday, Ken tried chalking on a doormat. Yep. Uh, well, we edited that out of the video because it did not work. But I thought it would be a great idea because I know there are people that go to Ikea and go to different places and they look at something and they say, I think I can chalk on that. But then they're not sure. So I feel like it is my civil duty to bring you all, can we chalk on that? Or will chalk stick to the? Or I don't know what I'll call it. Can we chalk it? Can, oh yeah, what was that? What is that one with the blender? Can we blend it? Are are any other chocolate designers on Twitch that you know of? 
No, and it better stay no, that way. No, it better Don't stay you that be way. Stealing my blue ocean, people. Yeah, I'm we, like, we like to keep I'm it kidding, that way. I'm just kidding. kidding. Yeah. I like to keep it that way. Don't turn me into <laughs> compliance, please. Well, they can't. They don't even know. They probably are even here. All right, guys. So, any other questions before we say adieu? I promise you, the forty-five days will not be all of Christmas, but it no. is my decorating choice right now. Um, we will definitely, before the first of the month, have our auction because we are getting pretty full. What happened to all the rest of our lids, Sean? We started on a Grayson board. I did. I did a Grayson board yep. and then I uh, I literally... No, we didn't start on a Grayson. We started on an Aiden board. Or an Aiden board. We don't have any Grayson Great, boards Not left. Grayson, but an Aiden um, board, yeah. Then we went to a Sylvie yep. because we thought, oh, maybe it was this and... It, I think it's the way we were doing it. We were re, we were not doing the pace and pull. We were trying to do something else. Where's the other lid, Sean? Oh, that, that one, Phil. Um, somebody's asking, can you, can they use this design idea? Of course. Of course. Absolutely. Of course, of course. You guys, I get a lot of my designs. If you go into our catalog, you're going to see that I got a lot of the inspiration from this board from our catalog, mm -hmm. which I wish they would call our inspiration guide because that's where I get a lot of my inspiration. Yeah. I might tweak it as I go down it, but for the most part, I try to get most of my inspiration from the catalog because I want it to be stuff that you guys also get inspiration from. Oh, so. that's right. Nyoko, she, she uh, did a metal metal saw by using yes. your son. Yes. That's right. Yes, 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 yes. Um, where are you going? A couple other boards people haven't seen yet. Since we have oh. some new people. Where are the rest of the lids, Sean? <laughs> they should all be right there. Hold on, let me check. Did I put them under? You might have. Oh, here they are. Did you find them? Yep. So this is what we call a double board. If you use two different boards. This uh, middle one here is the diagonal uh, reclaimed board. And we uh, painted it with white chalk paint. And did uh, the two different uh, transfers, and then embellished it with some uh, sprigs and red uh, berries and bells. And my favorites. Uh, once I get over there. This is done on an old window, so this is glass. And you can see the uh, reflection there of the light. So you could actually take this and then put lights back here and it lights, uh, it lights all up. Like maybe a string of uh, uh, LED lights to go around it. Could light this up nicely. This one is, this is one of my favorites that we've done. And we, and we have a sped up video on how we did that. Uses we very liberating. We have a sped up video. We did. Kenny did. Kenny did. Kenny did. <laughs> he did it all. I did nothing. Oh no! I couldn't do this without you. I know that. That is very true. Yes. All right, guys. So all right. There yeah. is another one. We will be back again tomorrow mm -hmm. for our forty-five days live. But I have to say, I'm liking the way that this turned out. How fun is that? Yeah, love it. That's my favorite, Nancy says. Oh, see, yep, that's Nightbot. I use Nightbot and I hated Nightbot. Yeah. We're going to change Nightbot. We'll change him. Yeah, we'll change it or just or lure it. Do something a little I different. remember now having Nightbot for a while on Facebook and I had to change everything to have him stop yeah. yelling at people because he got quite rude. Yeah. And I thought you need look to calm how, down. Look how good that looks. Yeah. All right, guys. Well, thank you for joining us. We'll be back tomorrow. If you have yes. any questions or information about Talk Tour, reach out to us on any of the social media platforms. I know. That would be fun. Awesome, guys. Well, thanks, everyone. Have a good night. Good night.